All right. So foundations that we've kind of covered so far is changing your mindset from what got you to here is not what's going to take you to there. So there's going to be a, quite a bit of change. Um, really getting specific and knowing who your avatars are and not being afraid to dock directly to them. Uh, what are some of the other like foundational things that you uh, we kind of we kind of hit on um, the tracking layer? Do you want to talk a little bit more about that and making sure that's set up well? Yeah, so tracking is super important, but usually it's not that. I mean, we have cases when it's complicated, and usually it happens when customers are using some um, custom um, CRMs and different platforms. I mean, I would recommend my honest recommendation would be to keep it as simple and clear as possible. Like if you have like um, a CRM, um, use some CRM. I mean, I know it might be more expensive, but it will be easier to connect some um, CRM that is well established and famous and it has all of this. Um, tools for connection, then also think where you host your web pages and which email system are you using? Because all of this like small pieces, if they're working together, they're maximizing your results and revenue. But if they're not working together and you're constantly missing um, connection, your, your funnel is leaking and, pe and some people are just not getting to your CRM, that's just the opportunities that you're um, that you're losing. So yeah, definitely that's one more thing that we are evaluating before starting active management. So that's as as Tom already mentioned, we have this now first month or uh, of setting up the I don't I, I'd say solid basement for our future cooperation, and one of this uh, activities that we are doing during this time is. Um, full um, audit of tracking if everything is tracked correctly if all is ever if everything is connected so yeah it's super important but yeah as as I said if you keep things pretty simple and clear it would be beneficial at the end of the day I remember we had customers who had like three four Facebook accounts three four Facebook pages three four pixels then free for like Clavio accounts and all of this like things. And it really took weeks for us to reconnect things correctly. So instead of like, I would, if you, if you're like just starting or if you're considering, I would say always keep it simple, not add additional like layers of complexity. It's not benefit like literally. <laughs> Yeah, and I'd say probably one of the basic things that you should be doing on a pretty regular uh, basis is getting the Facebook pixel extension on Chrome and going through your whole funnel and making sure yeah, that each of the events that are firing are fi actually firing at the step you want. And so you talked a little bit about a CRM layer. That's Is that mostly for like the offline conversion aspect? Uh, no, actually, if we're collecting leads, for example, lead forms, then CRM should be connected to um, to the Facebook, uh, to Facebook. And also, if we are running, if we're running any campaign to the landing page, if CRM is not connected properly with landing page, then you could be missing some um, leads or some contact information or even have some issues with fulfilling orders. So it's important in all cases, because at the end of the day, we um, as an agency, we want to go uh, one step further and we don't we don't only track um, performance in Ads Manager. It's also for us important to know the backend result, the actual revenue that you got or the actual amount of customers or amount of orders. And if there is an issue somewhere, then these results are not correct. That could be a huge, like, I mean, huge mistake. 